It's me, Raging Ripter, the creator of Arena. Some of you may know me as Tico Crump as well. Today, I'm going to show you some secrets that are in Arena. Me and the staff out here love to hide secrets. For the eight subscribers that we have right now, I would like to show you some secrets that we've hidden inside of Arena, in the order that you guys would like them the most. When I say that, I mean the least exciting ones to the most exciting ones. Uh, let's get started. The first secret is located in the paid games room. You see two paintings. You see where this is going. One of them brings you nowhere, while the other one brings you to a secret white room. This white room has not always been here, trust me, but it used to be used for our coming soon page, where you could see what we've been adding. We soon took this away for no apparent reason. So, uh, this is where you can kind of see what it would look like, I guess. The next secret is hidden inside our Five Nights at Freddy's game mode. Come join it in Arena Town for a total of three bricks. By the way, this only works if you're an animatronic. If you're an animatronic, head over to this room over here. And you can see the one and only man behind the slaughter beautiful man is also in the window of the FNAF game mode, so come check it out. Probably one of the more odd secrets are in the nether. If you jump in, but exit the wrong way, you'll meet a big bridge above lava. Keep going, and you'll just find nothing, really. But your own death, of course. The next easter egg, I should say, you know, thinking about it, is in the Donkey Kong game mode. Backstory before we continue. For Arena Town, there's a thing called festivals. I'm not going to go too deeply into it, though. Basically, there was one game mode in the festivals, which was a 1v1 game mode. And this tile floor is the floor that made that game mode. Just a little easter egg from the past. And you wing back with Donkey Kong. You can play as whoever you want while doing this. For Mario, simply look at this guy, the person who's controlling you, playing Donkey Kong, the classic arcade game. Next Easter egg is located in a hide-and-seek tower. Go to the painting. Go down under the cloud. You adore this is taunt him. Walk through. And you can literally taunt the seeker while he's looking for you. This next secret is also found in Arena Town. Walk in this house, climb up whatever this thing is called, I think it's scrap holding. You'll have your weekly challenges. Complete them for bricks. If you want more details on this, watch over our previous video on Minecraft Arena currencies and what to use with them. The last two secrets are amazing, so stay tuned. Of a classic arena board? Well, there's a secret including it. Go behind it, and you'll see this. It says drop. What does drop mean? Well, let's press the button to find out. After pushing that button, you will be sent into our Minecraft Arena Elytra Flying. It's an amazing new way of getting bricks. Why? Because every hoop you make is a brick. Want to see what the experience is like? Come here and try it yourself. No, I'm just kidding. Here's some gameplay. Be fun, right? Make sure to claim your bricks when you're done. Get to our last Easter egg. Here is an honorable mention. This is the vibe zone. Nice little place where you get to set your spawn and cook some pork chop. This place would have been third, but we have no way to access it yet. But when there is a way, expect it to be posted on the Minecraft Arena Pass. Before we continue, let's have a moment for TNT Spleef. T Spleef game mode, right? So, uh, <laughs> my friend!
desert dive. <laughs> it's gone. It's just, it's gone. Was it a tour roller coaster? Somehow, one of the TNTs came all the way over here to Arena 10. <laughs> Why am I? <sighs> I miss you. What? What? this long in the video that's great just so you know we just made a new game mode with the new update it's called farm war i think it's one of our best and it's free make sure you go and play it